No, sir. I don't like it at all. Greetings. I hope you're doing well. You know, there's a lot of things I don't like in this world. I do like good coffee. Mm. Yep. But one of the things I really don't like is censorship. Denial of freedom of speech. My friend Goxter recently made a video that was referring to the Muslim rage about the insults to their prophet. In my mind, insults to an imaginary friend. Anytime people go around rampaging and mob, you know, perpetrating mob violence and killing people over their religion, it's ridiculous. There, you know, deal with it. There is no such thing as gods. Your prophets are imaginary friends and or madmen. And you are fools for falling charismatic bullshit. Deal with it. That's the fact, whether you like it or not. It is not hate speech to say that. So, you know, get a grip on reality. The following is a mirror done by Goxter that was false flagged because it was called hate speech after referring to these issues. So, uh, here it is in its entirety. Please do watch it. And please do go to his channel. Subscribe. He makes great videos. And he's a great guy. But uh, if you can speak out about this thing and say something about it, please do. And mirror the video if you can. You can't do it directly. You can't just upload it. I had that problem. You know, apparently you have to at least change the name or do something. But I think that video was definitely worth watching. Peace and long life. Dear people of the West, we fundamental Muslim ask you please to not insult our Prophet peace upon him so often and in a row. Us Muslim today are visibly exhausted from doing protest after protest. We want the West to have a greater distance between two insults of our Prophet peace be upon him, and of Islam in generally. Please be putting more time between insults during a year. Muslims' hearts not feeling too good because of constant anger. Our families are scared the because we not be working from having to go so often manifesting in streets. I President of the UEIMF, the Union of Easily Irritable Muslim Fanatics, ask today on infidels, dear unbelievers, please don't be publishing so many Mohammed peace upon him insults at once. We be only human and you don't make it easy for us to show continuously our righteous anger and to maintain it for a long period. Oh, and by the way, dead to you infidels. Now, just when I arrive home from protesting the Mohammed peace upon him video, I just learned that the French magazine Charlie Hebdo be publishing new Mohammed peace upon him caricatures. Our health Authorities already give a warning of a dangerous increase in heart attacks and burnout disease within us radical Muslim fundamentalists. We be so tired all the time, our hearts be failing and our pockets be more empty all the time. We have families to feed. You think of our poor children who have to live without fathers. First, because all the martyrs peace upon them, and now as demonstrators, we not sign for martyrdom. Because we be only the protesting small minority Muslims, there be a great psychological and social pressure on us to be more violent. Many of us Muslim brothers feel if we don't not made it, no one made it. Even in private, we have to put back strongly. 
when we hear about the late video came out, I be refreshed and ready go throwing stones, a burning flex and show dare to the infidels, may they burn in hell, but now these caricatures in France, these make me angry too, but first I'm running out of breath, second I not believe I get again more free days from work. And thirdly, my Fatima at home will cause me problems when I get home so late and I smell always like gasoline. She asks where the money is for second wife and all the many children. Your infidels keep doing this and I got not my third wife because two wives complaining is too difficult for me. The UEIMF ask from cartoonists to Christian fundamentalists and right-wing parties ultimately to not or to insult Muhammad peace upon him only at most once a month and well distributed during the year. Uh, should infidels not meet our demands, the union of easily irritable Muslim fanatics will continue even more violent protest, but only in a few weeks, uh, if all have recovered.